is up everybody today i'm going to be playing pokemon mmo 3d and i'm going to be um you know some get to get some poke dollars by oofing some pokemon so i can get chloe my eevee into a jolteon so let's go so now we switched screen locations so now let's get to grinding and leveling up my Eevee, but first I'm gonna use Andy since he is my strongest Pokemon since he's like level 52 now. So as you can see guys, this is his level and I just want you guys to be so happy for him since I trained him for like months, I think. I don't know, but it's been like a month since I trained him. So I'm basically using Chart, I mean Andy to like, you know, get some poke dollars to get me a thunderstone uh, at the pokemart now in the pokemon in cinnabar island they give you so much it's like 100 poke dollars so if you pretty much just keep on oofing some pokemon you may be able to get some poke dollars and i don't know if jolteon really has like thunder shock or anything because well i haven't been seeing any videos of people actually doing Jolteon's showcase but I also cut myself a Growlithe which was cool but I don't want to use a Firestone on it because then I'd waste all of my stinking Poke Dollars on for a stupid Firestone because fire uh, I'm not really much to it since I like Thunder so I figured out the name Chloe myself well not really I just watch the Pokemon Master Journeys anime and I thought naming my Eevee after Chloe from Pokemon Journeys probably would have been good. Like, Chloe- OH! I leveled up Andy! So it looks like Andy level up. Look, see that's how many Poke Dollars I'm getting and I'm still grinding to like, you know, get some more Poke Dollars for my Eevee. Now let's press M and find the map. Yeah, there's nearby Pokemon everywhere, so. And people have been like grinding, like doing IV training in this house mansion, but every time, every single time when I go here, I literally just get killed immediately, which isn't fair at all, cause they should be like just the same CP or level. But no. Literally, they just oko me every time. So that's why I need that to be fixed. Since the Pokemon in that mansion, in the IV, in the EV, in the EV, in the IV training needs to be, well, like, um, nerfed since that's not even good at all because it needs a nerf. What the? Rattata! You ban Okay, so if you haven't known guys, I've been playing as Andy like so much to grind him. I evolved him to his final form. And I know you've been probably wondering, what about my Venusaur? Have I been training her? Well, I want to train her, but I also nicknamed her Flora since she is, since she does have a flower on her back. Which would have, which, which made a good name, but I need some like help out to get the other skins. I mean, I want the sun and moon skins like Sophocles, Mallow, and maybe others, but still, I just want more skins since I literally just got the golf girl skin and the collector skin. So I need more suggestions on where skins are in this game because I need more skins. I mean, I really need, I need them scans. I need them scans. Wait, what the? What? Oh, there's a Rattata. Now I keep grinding because I want to catch Articuno. Now, I don't know if Articuno is actually like, can be beaten by Charizard. But people have been like suggesting that the best Pokemon to fight against Articuno probably would have been Charizard since, well, Articuno is not that much of a good attacker against fire types. So 
So if there really is type advantages in this game, why don't they just add it? Though, I don't know if there really is type advantages, and I'm just speaking too much right now. But, I'm still attacking more and more Pokemon just to get Chloe to a Jolteon. Now, everyone watching this video might be probably wondering, what happened to my other Pokemon, like Pikachu? Well, he's in the box, because I don't want him to evolve into a Raichu, right? Because I'm keeping him as a Pikachu, kind of like how Ash does it. Now, people have been also... Now, I've been also watching Pokemon Master Journeys, and also, some people hate Go. I mean, I just don't get it. I mean, Go is like the one who wants to catch every Pokemon, so it doesn't make sense. Just stop being mad and hating Go from Pokemon Journeys. I get it, he catches legendaries, but that doesn't mean it's his fault. I mean, Pokemon decide to come with Go because they trust him. And they basically do. Kind of like how Suicune trusted Go into catching him since Suicune wanted to be caught so he can be saved. But later on, when in the end of the episode where Suicune was caught, Suicune decided to come with Go to be much safer and so he can go back and get fed anytime, which was just, ow! Okay been speaking too much though I really want Ash to like reunite with his Greninja cuz Greninja is like my favorite Kalos Pokemon and like Greninja I've been mostly using him in Pokemon Unite kind of and as you saw in my Pokemon Unite videos one of them was actually so cool since Greninja he was like so strong but I only like the fight with bots cause well I like the fight with bots since I well I like the fight bots on Pokemon Unite since it's kind of like so I can train cause I'm not ready for like more battles I mean Hoopa is my main but still I'm afraid I will lose again and I will lose my great rank which ain't cool I don't want to lose my great rank that's why I just keep myself away from the rank battles and don't do that much standard battles cause, cause some Pokemon need to be nerfed. Like, they kind of, um, I need some Pokemon to be nerfed so then it's easier for me to win battles. And I don't want my favorite Pokemon Greninja to be nerfed. I want him to have a buff on his double team. I want Greninja's double team to unleash like five different Greninjas. So it will confuse the trainer much better. And like, like this is how I want Greninja's double team to be upgraded. I want the buff to be basically when Greninja reaches to um, double team plus. He basically releases five random clones and it will confuse the opponent much better than the original since well I don't always often win as Greninja because you know Greninja is just too much and like I get annoyed sometimes by people who play as Greninja which I just don't like at all because they have to stop playing as Greninja and well I know I said that, but I still want to play as Greninja since he is like my number top one main. But but the but the build but the builds in Pokemon Unite are so much different because I have to like make a build for each of my Pokemon. Though the thing is, I don't know how to make a special build. But people have been probably requesting to use score shield with hoopa since if you use score shield it'll basically let you have a shield while you're scoring so i should probably use score shield on the next pokemon um on the next pokemon unite video and just like before i'm going with offline mode so it's easier and you won't see me start screaming in my pillow again like when i did with dragonite jeez 
I did not like screaming at the viewers. Well, I was not really screaming at the viewers. I was screaming with anger because of Sylveon. Because she's literally a dragon killer. I mean, Sylveon is like too mean. She's like too mean. And she needs like a nerf. Yeah, Sylveon needs a nerf. Because they don't often really use Sylveon. And people normally use Sylveon because of her insane mystical fire buff. And geez, that is insanely broken, which I don't like at all, since whenever I play like standard or ranked matches, I, I lose all of the time sometimes. But with Hoopa, I don't know, cause she might let me down. Cause, well, some people on my team, like, well, it, you can also think of strategies of beating a Duraludon on a different team. Yeah, it is possible to beat someone as a Dur with a Duraludon. Well, not really. Like, a Duraludon with a team. So, you can beat a person that is a Duraludon. Which is insanely cool, since no one has beaten someone with a new Pokemon release. Well, we just don't know that yet. Well, let's check our... Oh my god, we're so close. Dude, guys, we're so close on to getting Chloe to her evolved form. Guys, this is just too long. So we're just going to like s sort of speed it up with my Kind Master. And this time, I will use my Kind Master, guys. I promise. I pinky promise. But it will take a lot of work. So... Just make sure you thumbs up the video so you'll like it. So anyways, let's go!
learn a thunder move. She can learn a thunder move. She can actually learn a thunder move. She can learn. She can learn. She can learn an electric type move. Wait, what? No, no, no. That's not possible, can she? Let's check her Pokédex to actually see if she can learn. So we got the Pokédex. Now let's check on Chloe. Yeah, there's Jolteon. <gasps> what? Level nine, you get Thunder Shock. Wait, but isn't 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 my Eevee already level nine? Well, she's already passed. So does that mean she can already learn Thunder Shock? Okay, let's see her moves now. What the? She can't learn those moves. She actually can't learn those moves. Wait, what? I'm surprised. Chloe can't learn those moves. So anyways, guys, bye. I'll see you guys later.